So I have a student asking a very good question here as far as how many NBME questions per day should he study? I've made clips discussing the importance of memorizing the NBME content prior to your USMLE. Okay, lots of content on this stuff, how uh, you're going to memorize NBMEs 20 through 30 for step one, as well as 6 through 11 for 2CK in addition to the clinical mastery series, the NBME subject specific forms. But the student wants to know how many questions per day should he be doing? One form, okay, or more than one form, half a form. So I will address this point because it's not the same as QBank. All right. So before we get started, allow me to be my frequent asshole, tell you to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Help grow this channel. Share with one of your friends prepping for your smilly. Help build awareness for this channel. Hit the like button. Hit the bell if you want notifications. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical. Link is down below. And find me on Telegram. Recently created a Telegram group and channel. Links are down below. Now let me address the student's question as far as how many NBME questions per day should he do? Look, I've made prior clips as far as covering QBank is concerned that you should not be doing more than 40 to 80 questions per day. I never recommend more than 80 questions per day in UWorld because it means people aren't reading. I understand some of you might have faster pacing, but I will never recommend more than 80 per day in UWorld pretty much always, okay? When we talk about, and I don't want, I don't want to get too heavy into UWorld right now. I said I would discuss NBME. When we uh, are referring to the NBME content, one form per day, okay? So e.g. you'd look at NBME 20, you'd go through that form. You're, there, there are no explanations for 20 through 24 for step one, as well as six through eight for 2CK. You can, of course, find bootleg explanations online. I will generally give students two to three days to go through each NBME exam, okay? Uh, if you are getting fewer questions wrong, it's obviously not going to take you as long, okay? But because I want you reviewing even the correct questions from those NBME exams, it should still take you minimum two days to get through each NBME form. And if you're scoring uh, lower, it should take you about three days, okay? And it also gives you a bit of conviction and comfort in knowing that it's okay. Yes, it's a good idea to be spending two to three days per NBME form, okay? It's not a waste of your time. So you're going to be memorizing NBMEs 20 through 30 for step one. When we talk about the clinical mastery series for 2CK, I never recommend doing more than two per day. They're 50 question forms. They're very dense, okay? Very, very dense. Even though they don't come with long UWorld style explanations, just the process of reviewing uh, from finding info online uh, and actually physically going through the 100 questions, if you do two of those forms, it's mentally exhausting. We reach a saturation, okay, as far as our ability to not ADHD the fuck out going through questions. So the short answer is never more than 80 questions per day for UWorld. When we talk about step one NBME forms, one form on a day and then two to three days to review. When we talk about 2CK, clinical mastery series forms, you're going to be doing no more than two per day. There's a lot we can talk about. I'm not going to make this a 39 minute clip. All right. You know the deal. I'm going to continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.